you know, we create a, a golden opportunity for ourselves. Uh, bases loaded via the three walks. Uh, you, you think that uh, where we are with the guys coming up, particularly uh, we, we get some matchups that are in our favor. Uh, unfortunately, they make, you know, Duke make, give him credit. He made a couple of pitches, gets a couple of key strikeouts. Um, and then to, to lead off the 10th, uh, you know, uncharacteristic of a leadoff walk by Craig. Um, but then where, where we've got a chance to put Abreu away with the two strikes, 2-2 two, two count. I know he's trying to elevate a fastball away from him, uh, stay out of a hot zone, which is down and away, and ends up pulling a fastball down the way that ends up being the difference in this one. But, you know, the way Stephen Wright pitched tonight, just uh, an outstanding game on his part once again. Uh, with, with guys in scoring position, he was able to get a key strikeout on a couple of occasions, one to Cabrera, one to Lowry. Um, just kept the game under control emotionally, made a number of quality pitches. Like I said, uh, an outstanding effort on his part. Doug, can you just take us through your decision making with when to use Pedroia, not in the seventh, and then for Shaw, you know, not in the seventh, maybe later? You know, one, we're trying to give Petey a day off. Uh, it was, uh, I think, something he needed. Uh, but then in the, in the bases loaded situation against a left hander, um, which obviously is a better matchup for him, that was the choice there. Um, I, I don't know what the other opportunity you're talking about in the seventh. You know, Vasquez swinging the bat pretty darn well. Uh, two base hits tonight. On a night we get four. Uh, and not going to use three guys for one spot right there. John, the fact that you stayed with Steven through the night is just a sign of how much confidence you're having him right now. Yeah, and even in the ninth, you know, he gets a what looked to be a routine ground ball off of Cabrera uh, that, uh, you know, Marco double pumped a little bit. But still, I thought he was in complete control of the game. Out is so effective against the you know, three secondary pitches with downward action, able to put the ball on the ground routinely, curveball, cutter, or slider, as well as a split finger. Uh, he stayed out of the middle of the plate, and then he's able to elevate fastballs uh, for some swing and miss. So whether it's in this uniform or with the Royals, or excuse me, Orioles, uh, he's been an effective pitcher against us. I don't know whether in a safe situation, maybe there's a little bit more sense of urgency on the part of the, the opposition where they might offer some pitches just off the edge. Um, you know, that, that, that's the only thing I can probably point to at this point. I can't say that he's a different pitcher in a non-save situation. Going to Craig on or three days in a row, is that something that you've talked to him in advance? Make sure he's feeling good he wouldn't be on the mound if he wasn't. Able, you know, he threw 24 pitches the last two days. Uh, was in was in good shape as far as from a physical standpoint. But uh, no, he's been great about acknowledging if a day when he's might be less than 100%. But uh, he felt fine through the early work this afternoon.